that's a very good Android here. So, recall that after the US ban hit Huawei hard, it had to step down some of its usual devices. The company could not release two flagships every year for obvious reasons as they were unable to purchase some key components to make smartphones. But now, all that is water under the bridge as it is set to resume or you can say it is getting back into the track. So the Chinese manufacturing giant Huawei is all set to restart its usual dual flagship release within a year. The Huawei Mate 50 was released last year and the Huawei released the P60 series this spring, which was a major hit inside of China. And now, there are reports that Huawei will launch the Huawei Mate 60 series in the second half of this year. This means that Huawei's product release has finally returned to the P series in the spring, which is the first half of the year, while the Mate series drops in the fall, which is the second half of the year. Well, this is the dual flagship strategy that Huawei is known for. And if you don't know, only Huawei is the one which manages to launch two big flagship phones in a single year. And after like a lot of struggle, I don't know how, but the company is back into the two flagship launch strategy. Well, the report from the tech blogger Wisdom Pikachu claims that Huawei will release the Mate 60 in the quarter third of this year. Combined with the previously disclosed information, this time, the Mate 60 series will be equipped with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 4G chip. However, this chip will not come with the 5G base band. It's sad that it will still rock the 4G chip, but at the same time, it is rumored that the Mate 60 Pro might bring the second generation variable aperture, large camera sensor, larger than the P60 Pro. So it will further enhance the camera abilities of the phone. So yeah, what do you think about this major news of Huawei? Well, let me know your thoughts on it in the comments down below. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.